I had to come to the understanding that, that there was a lot of fear there too. Yeah. You know, uh, intimate relationships can teach us so much about that fear yeah. and, um, nice guys, men who want to be with strong women are going to be facing that fear, fear of loss or fear of, um, unworthiness. Uh, so many, so many fears yeah. show up for us there. Yeah. What, so can we talk about one of yours, but we'll put you on the spot. Like what yeah. in your relationship, what Please. was a fear you were, you were aware of? Uh, the one that I processed the most, and we can expand on it is the fear of being exposed. Mm. you know, exposed for who I am. And that's the reason why authentic relating was a pursuit of mine. Mm. It's like, I knew that that was coming from in here somewhere. Mm -hmm. I personally had so, so much of the blinders on that I couldn't see it for myself. So I, I needed the reflection of men's work. Yeah, I needed the reflection of a counselor who's trained to help me sift through that. Yeah. Um, and what I've what I've come to see and read a little bit more about the masculine is that where, where our greatest area of growth is, is with shame. Mm -hmm. And there's so much shame behind fear. Yes, it's so true. Yeah, it's these, these self-beliefs that we have. And, and um, I'm, I'm sort of hesitating because I was going to share a personal story, which is quite vulnerable. Um, at the end of that marriage that I described, you know, I had a lot of shame. I felt less than, um, I felt unworthy. And so I actually, um, I did an exercise where I, I, I went camping for two days to really have solace. And I wrote down all the things that I was ashamed about. And you probably remember reading about this in the book. And some of them were pretty fucking edgy, I will say, you know, to admit that. And then I went and read that to two people that I trusted. And wow, it was a it was a real freedom creator, you know, just to speak these things. And I think I think that's a lot of where men's work is really good because you can have men being sharp with other men and also creating a safe space to then to also reveal. And it tends to burn out the shame. I mean, you know, we all know that light, whatever the phrase is, you know, shine the light on shame. And that's what kind of cleans it out the most. And I think that's a lot of what men's work can can provide.